Let's go over how you can place text on a path using Affinity Designer for the iPad. So I'm gonna grab my ellipse tool and I'm going to draw an ellipse on my canvas because that is the shape I will be placing the text around. So I'm gonna tap and swipe to draw it. I'm gonna tap with three fingers so that I can draw it from the center out. And this is the path. Let's say this is the path I wanna place the text on. To do that, I just have to grab the artistic text tool and then I wanna make sure I tap just outside of the circle. Now, wherever it is that you tap is gonna determine whether the text is placed on the outside of the circle or the inside of the circle. So if I, close, if I tap closer to the circle, it's gonna place it on the inside. I'll place it, I'm gonna tap just outside of the circle and as you can see there, it placed it on the outside of the circle. So if you're unhappy with the placement of the text, you can just tap with two fingers to undo that and then try again. Uh, I'm happy with that placement there, so I'm gonna leave that. And once you've written your text, you can just minimize the keyboard. And you'll notice you have these handles on the left and right hand side of the circle. Uh, this green handle right here represents the start point of the text. So I could place this green handle over here on the left, on the left hand side of the circle. And then this handle over here represents the end point of the text. So if I move this in, it's gonna change where the end point of the text is. I'm gonna take the end point and place it on the right hand side of the circle. So I have the start over here on the left and the end on the right. And now I could just center this text by coming over here to the text settings and looking for the alignment. I'm gonna change the alignment to centered. And now we have text centered on the path like that. Now, if you wanna create additional text for the bottom of the circle, you'll just have to create an additional circle and then add text to that, to the inside of that circle using the same method. So that's how you can place text on the path using Affinity Designer for the iPad.